Torches for Flies number 25. Two days before Christmas, hide a spider up the chimney. That gives him a full day to weave some magic for us. Take the bugger out on the 24th and place a blowfly in the middle of his juicy web. Spray him down with icky reindeer pheromones. Now, glue another fly onto the handle of a rake man trap. Wait patiently for the senile fat bastard. He should have checked his list twice, cause tonight he's dropping into a naughty house. The fly's in prime position for a joyride on Santa's titanic scarlet ass. Normally the old fogey wouldn't hurt a fly, but tonight we're gonna change all that. While he's unconscious, climb onto the roof and glue a crap load of flies all over those beautiful antlers. And stick a heap on that ringer thingy inside his bell. Stuff a female pantomime deer head on your chimney. Feed the reindeer a muesli mix of oats and erectile enhancement drugs. Finish off with a few more squirts of pheromones, then get the fuck off the roof and watch the shit at the fan. There's only one thing more dangerous than a randy reindeer, and that's eight randy reindeer! Ah, uh, looks like the commotion's woken up old Soggy Brain. He's wondering what the hell's going on up there. Santa always meets his problems head on. Looks like there's only one left standing. Trouble is, he's got a nutsack full of jingle bells and he's ready to ring and roll. Don't worry, Santa always comes prepared. He won't forget this Christmas in a hurry. Still, Santa is a pathological optimist and usually tries to make the best of any stuffed up situation. No! Silent night, my ass.